morning, OGs. It is day one in Miami. If y'all caught up on all the previous vlogs, then y'all would know that I recently said that I was coming to Miami, so I'm here now. I arrived last night. I completely was thinking about this, and I was like, hmm, I've been to Miami maybe four, four or five times and never ever vlogged any time I was in Miami. So this is my first time ever vlogging in Miami, and I'm super excited. I got a whole itinerary, all that stuff. I got to switch y'all down and read y'all some to list, baby, but y'all, I'm super excited. <laughs> All right, y'all, so I'm in the kitchen now. So let me catch y'all up and read to-do list. So today is March 24th. I'll be here for about five, four days, I think. Because technically you don't count the day you leave and you really don't count the day you arrive because technically that wasn't even a day. That was technically not even half a day, baby, because we got in, we ate came back and went to sleep for the next day. So today is really the, the day day where it, when it actually starts and when we're actually doing things. So let me reach out to do list. Look at this y'all. I've spoiled my friends with itineraries. So this is how I be coming baby. Like everybody always wants your girl to make the itineraries. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna make it because I love making itineraries. I love having everything that I'm gonna do when I'm um, vacationing or traveling I like to have it all in one space so that I can go and look at it and so there's technically like my to-do list but it's not my to-do list but it is my to-do list because it keeps me in line and I like it so today on a to-do list first things first was 8 a.m. which I did wake up at 8 a.m. but I lay down because I had nothing to do till later on because my friends they actually were getting their teeth cleaned and whitened this morning at around 9 a.m. so that place was about an hour away so they aren't back yet, but they should be back arriving like around 11 o'clock. So they went, did that this morning. I stay here, lay down, watch my videos again. My editor sent back another video that they finished editing, so I watched that. And then now I'm about to actually get ready, take a shower, do my makeup. My hair is already zed, y'all. I got me a little fishtail ponytail. I wanted like a straight back, but I wanted something different because I always do like regular ponytail, so I was like, okay. I don't know if y'all can tell, can you see? But a girl got a fish tail on herself, so I gotta pretty much redo my little edges a little bit and then do my makeup, but the other day I'm good and get out my outfit. So I made reservations because I wanted to go to this place called Sexy Fish here in Miami, and I made reservations for 115. It's 1048 now, so we gotta be heading out on the itinerary. It says 33 minutes from the Airbnb. And then at three o'clock, not sure what time we'll wrap up there, but at three o'clock, we're going to be going on a yacht. Every time I came to Miami, your girl has been on a yacht. Like, that's going to be the tradition. Every time you in Miami, get a yacht. And then we were supposed to go to the, um, these different spots like Ocean 10 and the Sugar Factory to get like a drink. But I don't know if that's going to fit into the schedule because I don't know what time we're going to finish eating. And if we can swing that and then swing and make it to the yacht. Not sure, but we'll see. And that is pretty much everything on the to-do list today, which is a Friday. So happy Friday, y'all. Let me sit y'all over here so I can show y'all a better look at my hair. Y'all probably can see it better. All right. Can y'all see it, man? Do y'all see the details of the fish tail? I can't tell y'all because when I'm turning around, I can't see. Let me show y'all right here some. You kind of can see it. It's like a little avatar ponytail. So I'm about to lay on my feet. Let me show y'all what I'm wearing today. So I gotta pack, well, where it fits is sugarfish, and then I have to pack maybe two looks for the yacht because you don't wanna get pictures. So I'm gonna pack that so that we don't have to come back to the Airbnb. We can just head straight to where we need to be. So I'm gonna get all that together, everything I'm bringing on a yacht, and then what I'm wearing straight to the restaurant. Well, one thing that I forgot to do today when I arrived was unpack, but I only like unpacking my luggage and sitting it in the closet and in the drawers and doing all that extra stuff when I'm gonna be here for a while. I'm not considering this a long trip because I mean, like I said, the first day don't count because the day you arrive, so technically, you know, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, that enough time for me to be unpacking my luggage. And y'all, you won't believe it, I actually packed ahead of time when I did my luggage. I packed the day before because the day we left, we had a late flight, which I love because that makes your girl get a lot of things done in one day. So I got my lashes done, my wax, and I also got my hair done in one day on the day that I flew out, y'all. So. That's a tip if you want to get everything done and fresh because I like my lashes fresh. I like my hair fresh. So I try to get everything that I'm doing, well, everything like that, like my pampering, the day of, and then just have like late flight. So, I mean, it wasn't late. It was 4 o'clock, but I started my day early because I got my lashes done at 7 a.m. And then hurry at 9, and then wax at 11 45. And then by the time I got back home, I was good and I could relax because I was already packed. So, 
let's get out my fit for today. So this is the fit and the look. Y'all know I got my little organizing things. These are on my Amazon storefront. If y'all want to organize all your clothes when you're traveling, it's so much better. It makes everything so much neater. So I'm wearing this top with the bottoms and then these shoes. And then I got my accessories, like my earrings, and then I got my shades, so let me get that. I make sure when I'm packing like my jewelry, my sunglasses, my purses, all of that, I do it on my carry-on, so that's why I got some luggage, y'all. I didn't really overpack because I technically packed a fit for every day, like literally every second of the day, I packed the fit for, and maybe like a few extra swimsuits, maybe a couple of other, you know, chill fits, but this is the bag that I'm wearing with the look. And then I'm wearing L-O-R-V-E, World Record, Peachy. So this is going with the look. And then I like this because, look at this, y'all. I like that it has the little, I think this is typically an orange, but we are gonna call it a peach, baby, because the shade is called peachy. So you see how that ties together? And then the earrings, I put all my earrings in my Lord Ray case, is these. And I didn't even know when I ordered these that they are actually um, clip-ons. So like the Chanel earrings I got from, actually they're right here. These, y'all know, the ones I got for Lady. <laughs> these are clip-ons. So when I bought these, I didn't know, but they are actually clip-ons. So this is going to be the earring accessory. Let me show y'all close. You see, ain't they so cute and different? I don't think I'm gonna wear no rings because I can't get no rings over my freaking fingernails because of these little charms. The only finger that I can get a ring on is this one. All right, y'all, so I laid the fit out so that y'all can see it all together. And I don't know if y'all noticed, but it has these little bow detailing on the back of the shoe, and I thought this was just so cute. And then the bag, which matches the shoes. Y'all see, y'all see, y'all see, y'all see. Okay, y'all, so I had two ideas for something on the yacht, but I think the one thing that I was gonna wear on the yacht, I'm actually not gonna wear on the yacht. I'm gonna change my little vibe around. So I got this from Skims. And I thought this was so cute because it matches. I mean, by the time y'all watching this, y'all ain't gonna know what it match, but y'all see and y'all see. But it's beside the point chat because I'm wearing it on a yacht and take pictures. And then it has this top. Oh, baby, this is gonna be so cute on my skin. And then you got the hair straight back with the fish tail. And I just realized too, we're going to sexy fish. So, sexy fish, fish tail. I also have this swimsuit, which I bought both because I didn't know which one I want to wear, but I think I'm end up doing the pants in the bikini top. But this is the other swimsuit. And then I had a colorful, colorful, like two piece. Okay, so this was the colorful two, two piece, the other outfit that I was talking about that I was gonna wear on the yacht. And I think, I mean, this would be cute on the yacht because I have a swimsuit to go under it, some shades, and then these are the pants. But I also think this would be cute to just walk around in. So I think I'm just gonna go with the silver look. And then have my shades with that and then my regular sounds. And then I'm good to go. So let's get in the shower. All right, y'all, I'm out of the shower. I gotta hurry up and do my makeup in a good smooth 10 minutes because, child, that place is pretty full. Maybe because it's traffic, but we started we gotta be leaving the house, which I like that new freaking Apple update because you can tell when you need to leave the house so that you know what time, so that you can be on time where you need to be. But it says we need to be leaving our house at 1225 to make it to the restaurant on time to make the reservation. So, and it's like 1130. So your girl gotta brush her makeup and put her clothes on so that we can be on time because they said that it is a $40 fee, y'all. $40 if you don't make it per person. Crazy, right? Yeah. I'm about to go ahead and bust this makeup in a cool, smooth 10 15. Throw my clothes on. I'm going to be out of here. All right, y'all. So I basically finished my makeup. Now I'm about to do my lips, actually. I forgot. Freaking bake, y'all. How did I forget to do that? Put my powder on. I really missed a step because I'm rushing. But I'm gonna put this on, then while this sit, do my lips. And I'm already good to go. All done with the makeup. All right, y'all, now I'm about to do my lid, my edges. 
And I literally just realized that I didn't bring no edge control. So, I mean, they still look good. All I gotta do is just kinda swoop them back a little bit. All right, y'all, makeup is done, hair is done, edges is done. Now I'm gonna close them. All right, y'all, so I'm dressed. I don't have on my shoes because I don't wanna put it on now. But y'all, the love Vase, L-O-R-V-A-E, turned up the freaking look. Got the bag. It looks so cute and dainty. I feel like the glasses really is what making the outfit stand out like. <laughs> All right, you guys, so we is out the house now. Your girl is dressed, as you can see. I finally put my shoes on, ain't that so cute? But we had a train. Look, y'all, we gotta wait for this train to leave before we can go. I had to give y'all a look up close for the shoes again. Look at them. Bye. Look at this bathroom, y'all. This bathroom is freaking crazy. All right, guys, so we just finished eating and a food, y'all, 10 out of 10. And then at the end, a lady who was serving gave us free lemon drop shots. And baby, that wasn't even a shot, but it was so freaking good. 10 out of 10. I forgot to show y'all the bags that we got from Sexy Fish. Look at this, baby. These is looking like shopping bags, not no to-go bags with to-go food inside of them. Look at this. Fancy. This is the boat. All right, you guys, so we have made it onto the yacht. I'm actually about to get ready to change. She was giving us a little tour around the shit, baby. It's so nice, let me show you. So this is when you first get on, y'all, and then you get up to go to the front of the boat, and it also has somewhere you can go at the top, and then you go in here, okay. and we have a little couchy out here. All right. Got this little area, y'all. Got a freaking kitchen. And then down here, we got bedroom number one, bedroom number two. We got double beds. And then bedroom number three. And then this is a bathroom where I'm about to come and change and put on my swimsuit. Okay, y'all. So we are actually moving. So your girl is literally hanging on the bed right now. I'm about to put on my jersey. Oh yeah, this is cute. Woo! There we go, there we go. Alright y'all, so I am dressed. I got on my little swimsuit, baby. I accessorized, as y'all seen, with my silver jewelry. Let me step in, baby, because it's so bright. So this is better, baby. Alright, so we got on the shades. We got in a swimsuit. We're about to go to the, to the front of the yacht and take pictures, listen to music, and vibe out. We got everything in the cooler, ice, water, cups, drinks. So what we got, bartender? Okay, what we have today is mango margaritas. Right here, we're gonna add a little kick to our Casamigo. <laughs> I'll do that. <laughs> With the little babe, L-O-R, B-A-E, Casamigo Y'all walking on the side. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, this is scary. Oh, y'all, we is relaxing in the inside because he's burning up out them. But we're about to go back and lay in the water. But I'm relaxing and chilling. Front of the boat. <laughs> Yo, look. Let's go here, walk it to the side. Here we go. Cause <laughs> I, 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 no, no, camera, 
Hold on, look. Look at these pull-ups, y'all. Look, no assistance. Y'all see Big D? Look, hanging on the yacht. How many people you know that is doing pull-ups on the yacht? I'll wait. All right, y'all, so we is at the top of the movie freaking boat. Y'all, y'all see the edges still? We about to take another shotty. And you about to drive the boat. Cheers. Cheers. It's a parade. Alright y'all, so we are heading back to dock. It is 6-12 and we had the freaking yacht on until 3 to 7. So it's been a long time. And I'm craving some sweets because I haven't had nothing sweet since I've been in Miami. So after this, we're going to go to this place that we actually went to when we were in London. So stay tuned to see that because your girl is literally craving some sweets. I'm so sorry, baby. But it has been so much fun on the water on a yacht. Baby, your girl literally been leading y'all like, Go. Woo! Woo! I'm in my ah! Oh, they is literally up there working and blowing kisses. This whole time we've been riding on this river, ocean, wherever we at, baby. Like when we ride by, like when they doing construction, they literally have been hunking, whistling. Doing all types of stuff, baby. Like, they like what they see. I'm in Miami. Ah! All right, y'all. So, it is 7.06. We actually got a little extra time because, as y'all seen, the bridge wasn't up, so they had to lit it up. So, we had a little time until they lit it up. But it looks like we is almost ready to dock, baby. I'm ready to get off because I am hungry. I want some dessert. I want something sweet. But I had so much fun, y'all, on this freaking yacht. It's been a little party. All right, y'all. So we are literally docking back, as y'all can see. Look at that. We have made it back safely, y'all. Woo! Woo! We made it back. We want to give you this. Thank you. We taking the drop top off. Look at it! Hey! Woo! We got a green light, baby. We about to go. Ooh, they hunky, baby. They be too <laughs> impatient. Like you could be sitting at a green light for two seconds and they hunking a the horn. Like chill out, baby. All right, y'all. So we are in South Beach, walking to this dessert place. So we just walked across the street. And baby, I feel like I haven't been here in forever. Like. <laughs> So we have made it to the dessert place. I was telling y'all about child. Somebody's out there arguing. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> but it's a brothel happening. And I'm just trying to get what I need to get and leave. But if y'all remember the place we came to when we were in London with the waffle thingies and then you can put all types of stuff on it. White chocolate, dark chocolate, Nutella, milk chocolate. And then they have all these different things. We got our dessert. Oh my god. This one's dangly. How is it? Y'all, yeah. they have many V's and many V's. Alright, you guys. So we've made it back to the Airbnb. And your girl is tired. It is late. We got back eight leftovers and now I'm about to do a shower when I also got back because I just felt sticky getting out that boat. So I will see you all tomorrow. Good night. Bye. Good morning, OGs. It is day two in Miami. And I gotta reach out to do this, but before I even do that, I wanna show y'all the balcony and then I'm gonna get ready and reach out to do this after. So wait, let me show y'all. I didn't show y'all this yesterday, but I wanna show y'all now so that I don't forget. But look at this beautiful view. And then right over there, it's like, you know, water. And then this is the balcony to the living room. And look how big this balcony is. I wanted to show y'all the little polar rugs we've been taking. Look at them, y'all. Ain't they so cute? This is just a little bit of them, but y'all, these ain't mine. These is Kay's polar rugs. Shout out. She take these real serious. Both. <laughs> 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 you know, they 
I ran out of Polaroids, y'all. I said she take these real serious. She want all her Polaroids, Polaroids. even if I met them. If we end up chat, she want a Polaroids. Yeah, you know. <laughs> no, look at the drop. No, put it back and then put it back on. I want to show y'all the drop top in real life. Look at that. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> y'all, look at the drop top. Let me drive you up the street. No, yeah, it'd be, okay. it be they land vlog. <laughs> A little later. All right, y'all. So I'm actually gonna do a little try. Yeah, okay. I'm getting all mama insurance money. <laughs> y'all, y'all know I don't do oh. gas cars. Oh my god. Let you only. <laughs> Jesus. Slow down, dear. Dear. Dear Taylor. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. I'm gonna do a loop a loop. Can you a loop a loop. Can you show the people it's 8 o'clock in the morning while she's screaming to the top? <laughs> Y'all, look at this. It's 9 or 5, and we decided to go for a little morning spin. Joy ride. Before we actually get ready. Joy ride. Gun it. Gun it! y'all so we have made it to this little breakfast spot called bagel bar and baby they got all types of bagels in there i'm pretty sure y'all seen the little b-roll but i didn't get no bagel but i should have because i seen a garlic bagel because your girl love garlic and blueberry <laughs> blueberry bagel with blueberry cream cheese and we got these fresh juice so let me show y'all y'all by the way the owner well he looked like the owner i don't know if he was really the owner child but he was so nice gave us three of these cookies that we look at them like dang these jumps look good and i touched it and it's so freaking soft three big old cookies for free and we got some fresh juice all right y'all so these are the two juices we got orange pineapple and orange mango baby all right about to try it Mmm, mm, y'all, this is good and it tastes fresh because it is fresh, 100% natural. This tastes like real squeezed up, squeezed up oranges and mango. Ten out of ten. All righty, y'all, our food is ready. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. Sierra's in the car telling me to run up on these crocodile lizard things that she didn't see. They want me to observe and tell me I get the camera. No, sir. All right, I'm not dying for the vlog. Now back to your regularly scheduled program. All right, y'all, so we are back at the Airbnb from uh, getting the light breakfast. Now I'm about to get ready, but let me read y'all's do list because I haven't done that yet. So today we're actually going, going to be going to South Beach, but we're only going there to go to these two places to get drinks. Like, I want to go to Sugar Factory so I can get one of the nice, cool little drinks with all the little smoke. And then we're going to go to a place called Ocean 10 that has Miami Vice. So we're gonna go to those two places for drink shopping. We got first stop, we got second stop. They two minutes apart, so we're gonna walk. That's all on the itinerary, y'all. I don't play, my itinerary is detail. And then after that, we're going to either go to the beach. I'm trying to figure out if we're gonna go to South Miami Beach or if we're gonna go to one that we found that was private, but it's an hour away. Not sure what we're gonna do after we get our drinks. So that's why we had to get food too because you can't be drinking on him. Sunday, Sunday guy. And also y'all, so I was on Instagram and I keep, this keep coming up on my like explore page, but it's like South. It's like a guy who sells South. He has like a food truck or something like that, but he's posted his address. He is about 45 minutes from the Airbnb. So maybe, we, and he's 70, 47 minutes from South Miami Beach. So we may do that because I want to try y'all. I literally had this just saved on my Instagram just so that I can go and try it because I know, okay, so let me tell y'all. So his is called South. It's S-O-U-S-E. But his junk look like it's like a soup or something like that. I don't know, but it look good. But when I had salsa, when I ate salsa, I remember it as like lunch meat. So I'm gonna show y'all a picture of what I had. Cause I grew up eating this with my granddaddy cause my granddaddy put me on to it. But this is what it looked like. This is what I remember eating when I was younger. You see that? You see? Just like this, in this little packet right here. But the way his look is like a soup. So let me show you what his junk be looking like. You see that y'all? Houston, this is the first one from Houston y'all that I know. Pork salad, we got pork salad and he got chicken salad. So y'all, I want to try because I'm like, baby, that looks good. What that look like? And what I remember, what I remember, salad is not that. So I want to try that. Hopefully, we're gonna go today. 
we'll see that's pretty much everything that's on the to-do list today yep that is it y'all oh i do have movies on the itinerary but that's gonna be later i have to look back at the movie times because this was on the itinerary for yesterday but we ended up doing the yacht we pushed the yacht a day before because he gave us a good little discount and he gave us a free little hour or whatever so we ended up pushing it back i mean pushing it forward so we might do the movies later tonight but other than that that's everything that's on the to-do list y'all i'm about to get ready all right y'all so i got all my looks laid out so this is an option i had for today because i don't know what i want to wear y'all that's why i laid them all out so i had this little one this is just like pants in the cover up with boats baby l-o-r-v-e copy up and then i got this look y'all i think i might go with this one because i think this is so cute with temptation and then i have like a straight back ponytail and i think these look so good when your hair is pushed back and then i still have yet to wear these shoes that my friends got me like two three years ago for my freaking birthday baby so i put it together and i thought it was so cute with the light shades and then the dark pink and dark pink and dark pink and then the light pink and oh baby in the gold detailing that's an option and then i have this as an option just like a little white top i got from zara it's like an oversized one and then it's like scrunched up, baby. And then my little sandals, which I have yet to wear these yet. Jeans and regular basic jeans. So, which look, y'all? So my makeup is already beat. Did the face. I don't have no edge curls, so I'm gonna have to get them when we leave here, but I kind of just swoop my lid, my edges and then they kind of lay the way they are supposed to lay, but they ain't lay laid. So that's why I put them on here until I get me some edge control. So I'm gonna any mini money mo catch you through your so out of these looks and put one on because I'm ready to get out of the house. All right, y'all, so I'm dressed already after changing three times because I put on every single look that I showed y'all and this is the one that I decided to go with because it's giving more South Beach. The others is more chill and shopping, so whenever we we go to like shopping, I can wear those. But this is the look with the baggy, the little vase, L O R V E, because both B O S T. And then I got on these shoes because these shoes match the shades, y'all see. And then y'all see the detail in the necklace with the green, period. So we about to head out. Let's go. Alright y'all, so we finally in the car, heading now. as you can see, my uh, baby dots are flying away, but we about to go stop at uh, Walgreens so that we get edge control so the girl can lay her edges. Let me double check, make sure I brought my uh, edge brush, cause, oh, got the edge brush y'all. Alright y'all, so I've made it into a CVS looking for edge control. I'm where the hair appliances, but all I see is shampoo, conditioner, stuff like that, no edge control. Y'all, look what I found. I feel like I can't find this one nowhere because child, every time I show y'all some vlog, next time I go looking for it, it be gone. But he got some here, so I think I'm gonna actually take this back home. All right, y'all, I asked for her gel, and he pulled me back to this aisle, and I walked right past this. Even though it don't have the exact edge control that I use, these don't have to do, so. Bag is secure, y'all. All right, y'all, so I ended up getting this one, because like I said, can't find it nowhere. Every time I tell y'all something, y'all go taking it away off the shelves, baby. But I found it in the Emmy. And then this is the edge control, well, gel. It ain't even edge control that I found, because they ain't have no other one, so. This will have to do. I'm just gonna put like a little dab on my edges, like cuz. All right, y'all. So I just used it, baby, and it laid it down the way it need to be laid. I still gotta finish this my size, but look at it. It did what it needs to do for my uh baby dopes. Y'all, I see her while we was driving. Look what she got on. I like your shades. L O R V A E. <laughs> y'all, we is literally on the way to South Beach, well, to this place called Ocean 10, but. We driving and Kay spot somebody was like, it looked like she got a little bag. She was riding her little bike. She pull up and I was like, they in the mid little bag, little R B A E. So I was like, I like your shades. And she looked like, girl, shout out to you, baby, with the little bag out in the Emmy. Moment that he knew he 
fucked up. All right, y'all. So you probably. <laughs> Wonder you why, probably wondering why we are now driving. Yes, I mean, we Uber. are in a freaking Uber. And let me tell you why. They took the car. They towed the car away. And we don't know why. They talking about the road was closed, y'all. That road was not closed. In all of 30 minutes. Miami in 30 City, minutes. Y'all wrong for this. Y'all are scamming out here because <laughs> that, that, let me, this side, we wouldn't have missed that, baby. That was not there. These that drinks, road closed, These side. drinks cost us more. <laughs> that is wrong. 300 bands, y'all. Three hundred dollars. I just always eat. I just always say beans at the every night. Three hundred bands, baby. Three hundred. She don't go to dollars. She goes straight. Ain't nobody tell y'all to take that car. Y'all couldn't live it where that car was right in. No, that car was not missing nobody. And then it said no parking between Thursday and Monday, six p.m. to seven a.m. So we have that. We house. good. We think we good. Soon as we park, that they put that car. They bust, no, soon as we park, they bust out laughing. Got him. Yes, y'all. That's what happened. We moved. We parked. We got out. Got us some drinks. We was feeling good, baby. And they moved that freaking and barrier. And taking shots like we got all the time. <laughs> they moved that barrier right down there where we was parked. <laughs> we just to, was just to get us some. <laughs> so let me tell y'all how it happened, y'all. We walked back. We got us a little extra drink. We came back. We thinking like, we walking and we see the car ain't let them on. We like, wait a minute. And Kay like, wait, we on the wrong street. We parking on the other street. I'm like, nah, man. We literally walked straight down. We crossed the street right straight down. It was no turning, no loops, no nothing. I mean, do that, and know. then we kept trying to convince ourselves we just didn't want to believe that our car was gone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, baby, it was gone. So, in order for you to get it, you gotta pay 300 billion. That is out of their mind. So now we're using the Uber, heading to get that car back because it ain't ours. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we have arrived, baby. Look at these tow trucks out here. That is wrong. Right. You wrong for this? Listen, see this right here? We don't pick up no cars and just pop the car up. When they give them a ticket, we're going to pick up cars. We don't take nobody car to the street. The only car we take is an apartment. We don't have a blue sticker. Like you ready to do they call us. They, they wrong for that. They, they wrong. wrong. Cause look at this, y'all. They got another one on there. Look at it. Yeah. They picking up cars by the I, second. I, 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 he was so nice, y'all. But he back there about to go take another car, child. He about to go go off. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. He about to drop that one off. About to get another one. Miami City, y'all scamming out here. Y'all wrong for y'all wrong for taking cars. Talking about they close, their road was closed. Knowing they road was closed. Y'all. Good. The summer company is good, y'all. They, they just had to do their job. But right, y'all, right, right. I know you ain't calling He said spring break. All the people came down here on spring break. Ain't know how to end. And now we can't for it. Oh, so spring break is the reason y'all over there charging 300 bands. Oh, no, that's just how much it is. That's just how much it is. All the way around is 300 bands. Year round. Let me count. Let me count. 300, 300, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. That's seven people, y'all. Do 300 times seven. That's how much money they just made. We are waiting on a car now, y'all. You own that. She got the slip, got the car back. Look, and they, oh, I called to y'all. I was literally just about to say that they ain't even pulled up. But here they are. It's back. Look at this, y'all. We got our car back, child. They unhand, they unhanded it. It's an hour now. They wrong. All right, y'all. So we is back in the car, y'all. We retrieved the car. They unhanded the car. Unhanded. <laughs> they gave it back to us, baby. But Miami City, y'all, is wrong for that. I know that towing company is doing what they got to do for that change. But, baby, y'all know that road was not closed. And I'm going to say it again. It was not, y'all. That sign was not right there. Talking about some road was closed. Talking about it was almost about to be closed. Now it was the not closed. The start of closure. How we supposed to know it was on the start of closure if they ain't got our closed road sign? Because it was not up there. Y'all wrong. And the Lord is watching <laughs> every single person who slid that road closed sign over there when we parked. Y'all wrong. <laughs> you will pay for the You will pay. We all have figured out our next business venture and it's gonna be getting the towing company in mother freaking Miami because baby they is making a guala. I tell you, you seen seven people right there, but like he said, our car wasn't there already because they did park it somewhere because that that freaking parking lot that they had them cars was overfilled. So you know what that mean? That mean it was so packed up that they couldn't even put our car there. So I'm thinking maybe 20, 50, 50 cars already there. So y'all added up 300 bands 
times 50 times 100. They is making bank and it's on a daily. All right, y'all. So right now we are heading. Oh, yeah, it's dark. Wait a minute. Let me come back. All right, y'all. So what I was saying was we have made it to our reservations because I made reservations at this place called Yardbird that I was put on to. And the food looks so good on Yep. So that's what we are heading to. Now we had three, two, three, three thirty. So that's where we're going. It's the money. It's, it's the money. We already ordered drinks and we're looking at the food. She said they known for this right here, fried chicken. So that's what I'm gonna get. We got cornbread and we got biscuits, y'all. I don't know what these sauces is, but I'm eating. We got some drinks. Cheers. Cheers. So since we are Patrick's Receipt Princess, we can have little drinks, drinks y'all. And she said this was a signature. So that's what we got, y'all. Just leaking over. I'm about to try it and give y'all a rating. What you got? Mm. What you got? This tastes like what strawberry lemonade. Um, order some. Order some. 10 out of 10. Cheers. We was getting seated and we told the guy that our car got sold and we was rushing here for our reservation so we yes. didn't miss him. Why did he say that they usually give homeless people phones so that they can call in cars to get money? A scam. My food has arrived. So I got fried chicken, y'all, and I got macaroni and cheese. This macaroni is looking fire fire. I'm about to try this. Mmm. Mmm. This is a 20 out of 10. Mmm. Burgers have arrived. Look at that burger, y'all. Oh Woo! Look at that, y'all. I'm about to try the burger. Mmm. 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 Alright, y'all. So they just brought out this right here. It's the honey hot sauce, so I'm about to try that on my chicken. So y'all know I don't like watermelon, I don't eat watermelon, but they had something different. This is spiced watermelon, so everybody's gonna try this, and I'ma try it and give y'all my new rating on watermelon. Well, this is watermelon, because this ain't regular. This is cooked spiced watermelon. 10 out of 10, what is it? Out of what? 10. Mexican, like the Mexican. Ooh, tahina. Yes, that, that's what it is, yeah. Smell like watermelon. Uh, I look at her and she still ate some more. I think I'll give it a five out of ten, but I still don't like watermelon. Mm -mm. All right, y'all. So we are back at the Airbnb. We came back after we ate because it's the last thing we did. Would eat a yard bird, came back, child, because we was tired, we was beat. That sun really was draining. So we came back here, and now we is up from like our nap trying to figure out what we doing next. Like I said, on the itinerary, and then on the to-do list, the next plan was gonna be the movies, but we should see because the next movie time, I think was 9.45 p.m. Right now, we just waking up, y'all, from our nap, child, and it was a great one. This side of the room is sunrise, and then you come over here, to like the side I was telling y'all about. With our front balcony, you can see the sunrise. You see the sun, y'all? Look, she going down. Wow, it looks so pretty. Like them pictures of the sunrise, like, I mean not sunrise, sunset pictures. So beautiful. So we just outside chilling after the nap, watching the sun set, not sunrise, kind of keep getting these mixed up. But we have yet to go to the rooftop because this place got a rooftop with a pool and a jacuzzi, all that. So, I mean, maybe if we don't do the movies, we could just chill at the rooftop because they do have like a little vibe up there and we still have yet to see it. So we might go up there and take a little peek peek. But child, I still want to see Creed because your girl haven't seen Creed. And not only is Creed out, you got Scream. And then I ain't even know about John Wick too because I never seen one or two. I only seen John Wick for the first time when three came out in theaters. And baby, I was like, oh, this is nice and interesting. And it had a lot of action. So a four came out. So I technically want to see that too, but I want to see Creed before I see any of those. But I definitely want to see Scream, y'all. All right, y'all. So we have came up to the rooftop so we can see the pool and the jacuzzi. Let me give y'all a better view of it. This is the jacuzzi. Yeah, it's warm. That's and this is the pool. Ah! That's warm too. That might be a heated pool. Look at this, y'all. Let's go look at the ambient view. Look at the beautiful view. Look at that. These are the palm trees. Y'all never been so close to a palm tree because they be so tall. And look, it's a tree right here. 
All right, y'all, so we are at 7-Eleven because we need some snacks. We decided to stay in for the rest of the night. So we wanted some snacks, y'all. I got me a Coke slushie. We got hot dogs in this joint. I like ketchup on my hot dogs. All right, y'all, so we have made it back to the house from 7-Eleven and I ordered lychee tea on DoorDash, so that's on the way. But, okay, so out of the two things, I mean, out of the to-do list and out of the pretty much the itinerary, what we didn't do today is get my sauce because I wanted to try it. So we're gonna try to do that tomorrow. We didn't go to the movies and we didn't go to the beach yet. So we're trying to figure out what the plan is. We have plans to do ATV riding. So if we don't do that, the backup plan would be the private beach, which is an hour away. And that sauce that I wanna try. So that is it, y'all. Well, I'm about to take my makeup off and get my lychee tea. And then I'm closing out and going to sleep. So I can start my day three in Miami. <laughs> y'all, look what arrived. My lychee I ordered. So I ordered two drinks, y'all. I ordered lychee tea. And I also ordered lychee matcha because I've never heard of it. But I got a small because I wanted to try it. But drinks have arrived. And it is, it's 11.15 p.m. Okay, I'm about to try this drink. Y'all, I ain't never had lychee matcha before. Now I'm gonna try this. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. This one tastes better. 10 out of 10. This one. Eight out of 10. All right, y'all, so I am tucked in, about to get ready to go to bed. So, good night, and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye. Good morning, OGs. It is day three, which is technically the last day in Miami, y'all, and your girl is sick. I don't wanna go, oh my God. I've been having so much fun. I've been so relaxed, just chilling, and just enjoying the weather because Baby, the weather back at home is nothing like the weather here. It's cold and it's rainy, y'all. Going back to rain, like who even want to go back to rain? I really high key, high, high, high key want to extend, but whatever. I got to reach out to do list and kind of give y'all insight on what the plan is for today. I don't really know, like we just been chilling and vibing. Like, I don't know what we doing today because the most exciting part and the most fun part that we did while we was here was the yacht. Like that was lit. I wish I could do that again. I want to do that again, but we're going to do something else. All right, y'all. So I'm on the itinerary and today is Sunday. So the plan we have is was today on Sunday is the wake up already fit check. Um, and go to the beach. So we didn't go to the beach this whole time since we've been here. So we want to go to like this private beach, I think it is. But we want to do that because we have indeed a beach and I want to walk on some sand. Then go to lunch slash brunch. We wanted to go to bacon, B-I-C-C-H. But they jump be jumping, but they have two locations. So we'll see what we looking like after the beach. Cause I'm not even sure if we're going to be there too long. We just kind of want to go relax, chill, feel it out. Walk on the beach, get your feet in the sand and then you know. And then later on at 5 p.m. we're supposed to do nighttime ATV riding. So, and then after that dinner, and then after that, the movies, a late night movie, because they have the latest was a 9.50 p.m. showing to see Creed, because y'all know the girl wanna see Creed, baby. They got a whole bunch of good movies out, but I wanna see Creed. I don't wanna see nothing until I see Creed. So we'll see what that looks like, because now science we probably ain't gonna do that. By 9.50, y'all, I'll be tired by 9 o'clock, and then I'll be in bed, and I'll be asleep by like 11 but we'll see. Dinner, not really sure. They do have a BJ's and y'all know I love BJ's, so may do that or may find like another restaurant. But that is pretty much everything on a to-do list for today. I'm just about to go ahead and throw, well, take a shower, then throw on my swimsuit and like some pants, chill, chill vibe to go to the beach because I don't think I'm gonna get in the water, but if I do, I have on a swimsuit, but if I don't, I still be good and I can still just walk right about. All right, y'all, I'm about to get ready to get dressed, put on my clothes, and then we're about to head to the beach. All right, y'all, so I am dressed and ready to go. I just put on this regular silver swim top I had, and then I put on unbothered denim with my gold jewelry. I wanted to do the silver top with the gold jewelry and then my necklace with green in it because it kind of like, matches my nails and then the yellow and my nails match the yellow in my glasses and then I got my denim bag my little bangle and then I have these regular brown cargo pants so we is already dressed and ready to go so we about to head to the beach all right y'all so we are walking to the car about to get ready to head to the beach we was gonna 
Uber, but I mean, we got a car and it's right here because we got traumatized when they took that car. So <laughs> we got to see when we get there, make sure we find legal parking and make sure the road is not closed. Make sure we can turn on the road and still don't see no sign though. But we about to go to the beachy. Drop the top. Yeah, I just wanted to kind of point out how, look at it. That edge gel, whatever the freak it was, because I think it was man gel. I think it'd be that type of gel that people use to stick their hair up or slick their hair back. But baby, look at it on the edges. It laid my baby duds. Ah! All right, y'all, so we've made it to the beach. We parked in a place that you can park. It does say tollway zone, but it also says park and pay. So we paid and now we good. Cars shouldn't be towed when we get back. Walk us to the beach. Made it to the beach, y'all. And look at the water. The water's so good. And the weather is so perfect. Ah! We about to get ready to rent one of those little cabana thingies back there. So they about to set us up, y'all, for our little cabana. So let's walk on there. Ah, so excited. Oh wow, this is nice. Look at the water, y'all. Look at it right here on the wall. All you can do, all you gotta do is just walk on up. I took my shoes off. I'm about to relax. We can get food over here. Oh yeah, the shade. Thank you. So this is the menu, y'all, that he gave us. And we can get order food for him right here in front of the beach. All right, y'all, so we're gonna be here vibing out. We decided not to do ATV because, baby, that is like 50 minutes away an hour, and we just chilling. We just got here. It's only like 12 o'clock noon. We just order food. So we just gonna relax. There ain't no point doing ATV, baby, because they too far, and we already vibe out here at the beach. Oh, look, something washed up on the ocean. It looked like a coconut from Jamaica. Came all the way to Miami. Put it back, y'all. Back in the ocean, it goes. Oh. <laughs> Look at my pants, y'all. They super soaked. What are you doing? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ooh, we. Food has arrived. Never mind. Thank you. Oh. Look at that cheese. Oh my on god, y'all. Mm, baby burger. Mm. Ooh, I'm gonna try this burger. Look at that. Mmm. Uh, the water, sorry, oh, it took me so long to drink. Mmm. Yeah, damn. Yeah. All right, y'all. So it is now 5 oh, 04. We literally been out here on this beach in our little cabanas. Walking up and down the beach, getting in the water, relaxing, sleeping, chilling, playing Uno since 12 o'clock. We've been out on this beach for a while, but they said they close at 6 o'clock and it's 5.05, 5, so we're about to get ready to head out, y'all. We spent our full whole day at the beach and it was so relaxing. I don't want to go home. I want to stay here forever. Y'all, we back and the car is still here intact. They have not towed it away. Thank you. Y'all, look at this. I got a freaking tan. Yikes. But we have made it back to the Airbnb. I'm about to get ready to get in the shower so that we can head out and get food. So I think we did decide that we are gonna go to BJ, y'all. And I cannot wait because the girl want a bazooki. So I'm about to wash my body off, take a shower, put on some clothes, and we about to go. All right, y'all, so I am dressed and ready to go. I got on my little outfit to go eat, and then after we go eat, we're gonna go straight to the movies, y'all, because it's in the same vicinity, so it's no point of coming back home and then hitting the gal. So I bought me a pack, I packed me an extra clothes so that I can bring it so I can change for the movies. Eventually. All right, y'all, so actually I changed because I'm not gonna feel like packing a bag to change before the movies. So I just end up changing so I can be comfortable when I eat. and. You Got on the clothes, baby, with our movie time. We already bought tickets. It's at 9.40, it is 7.27 right now. So we can get it here now so we can go eat and then go to the movies, y'all. I'm so excited to see Korea, y'all understand? We finally at the house, y'all. 
about to go get food. I am so starving. We haven't eaten since that burger at the beach. Y'all, like I said, this is the last day in the Emmy, baby, and it has been so much fun. And Miami don't owe us nothing, child, but they owe us one thing, and that's that money back from that towing company because y'all scammed us. All right, child, so we done eating. We made it to the mall, the movie theater. We're about to go see Cree. Obviously, I can't take the vlog camera. So I'll see y'all when I get back. Y'all going in the trunk. Bye-bye, guys. Good morning, OGs. It is the next day, y'all. And it is early in the freaking morning, baby. I'm so tired. It's 7.46. And today is the last day in Miami. Packing up, get ready to head to the airport, child. <sighs> it's been real. And y'all, I didn't close out the vlog last night because we got out of movies like one o'clock in the morning, one, two o'clock in the morning. But y'all, that movie Creed was so good. I enjoyed it a lot, baby. Like I came out of that junk like, mm, mm. you know how you watch like an action movie and you come out feeling like you could do what they do in the movie, y'all. But anyway, 10 out of 10, the movie was good. I loved it. What is up guys, after a long day of traveling because the last thing y'all seen was the flight and baby, we got lucky because we ended up getting on an international flight, like an international plane, I mean. So technically first class was Delta One, so it had the beds and all that good stuff, baby. But we got delayed. We literally sat on that plane after we boarded for like a good hour because I don't know what happened. They couldn't get the luggage on the, on the plane or whatever the case may be, baby. But we was literally delayed. Folks missed they uh, connecting and all of that. But I made it home, y'all. I took a big nap. It is 9, about to be 10 p.m. already. And I'm gonna be up all night because your girl went to sleep so early in the afternoon. Like, I landed, got food, got dessert, then came home, took a nap, and now I just woke back up not too long ago. So, your girl's gonna be up all freaking night. For the rest of the night. Also, I forgot to say that we didn't end up going to, to um, the Sugar Factory because remember on the day that we had like the drink hopping, we were supposed to do Sugar Factory and Ocean 10, but we never did Sugar Factory, which I guess was a good thing because we would that mean that car would have been in the freaking towing place longer than it was supposed to be because that's what we were supposed to do after the fact, but we had to. See, that was nobody but God telling us to go out there. You don't need to go to a sugar factory. You need to go and get that car because that car ain't even out there no more. But y'all, and I didn't get to try my sauce because that's why reading is fundamental. I wanted to go on Sunday, but he was closed on Sunday. He only opened, I think he said, Wednesday and Saturday. So I missed my chance on freaking Saturday and he wasn't even open on freaking Sunday. And I came back on Monday, so I couldn't even go on Wednesday. But... I'm going to have to go and try it out when I go back in May for work. So, yes, y'all. I hope you all enjoyed this vloggy vlog. And I enjoyed my time in Miami. And it was litty. And I will see you all in the next vloggy vlog. Bye.